Hi guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. It is Vlogmas Day 10 and I'm aware, yes, I am 100% cognizant of the fact that I didn't post on 8 and 9, but to be honest, I doubt any of you care. But <laughs> I said I was going to post every day, but posting on the 8th and 9th got really difficult for me because I had so many assignments. I literally just glued myself to my desk and just busted out all the things I had to get done. I had so many like things to do regarding the business and honestly, I don't want to bore you guys. But I am back. It's Thursday. It's the 10th. I finally have a day to like breathe. Today is going to be like a self-care organization day. And um, I wanted to show you guys what I purchased for Black Friday, Cyber, Cyber Monday deals. Um, I've literally had all of the things I bought in a corner in my room because I just wanted to show you guys. So I could finally do it and then clean and put away everything I bought. Yes, guys, don't forget to like this video and subscribe to my channel. Your girl would so appreciate that. Yeah, like Christmas is almost here. It's very exciting. Um, you know, COVID is kind of blowing up our lives right now. People are getting sicker. It's worse now than it was before, but let's... All right, guys, so really, I don't do any major Black Friday shopping just because I did purchase, like, clothes um, before my birthday and before I went to Mexico, so I didn't feel a need to buy more. I did purchase, like, makeup items because I haven't really bought a lot of makeup in a while, and what else? Like, I bought some gifts, but I won't show you the gifts that I bought for, like, friends and family. But I just got, like, random things, things that make me happy, and I want to show it to you guys because you gotta focus on the little things that make you smile every day. Okay, so we're going to start with Ulta. I actually went ham for Ulta. I went there originally on um, Black Friday because I had a giveaway on my business page and I wanted to just buy a lot of things for my giveaway. I showed you guys what I had in my giveaway in my other vlog. Don't have it anymore, but I will show you guys everything else. My room is a mess. Like I'm going to show you guys later, but I have things all over and I just can't wait to get this all squared away. So... I have a bunch of stuff from Ulta. I refuse to shop at Sephora anymore. Well, I still do sometimes. Not not really. I haven't shopped there since like months. But I love Ulta. Ulta is the bomb.com. Anyway, so I don't even know what to start with. Okay, let's start with skincare. I got a couple of skincare things. So um, I picked up, I've always wanted to try Kylie Skin. Um, by Kylie Jenner. I've always wanted to try one of her products. So the one I picked up was the Walnut Face Scrub. I cannot talk about this product yet because I haven't tried it. But it smells really good and it got good reviews. So I'm excited about this. All the Kylie products were on sale. I don't know how much I got for this. Oh, this is for what I bought in store. Let me pull up the receipt on my... Um, email just trust me it was a good price so I picked this up um, and yeah I don't really have anything else to say about this product because I didn't try it yet but I'll keep you guys updated in vlogmas so I got that and I also bought this product for my giveaway winner but I also picked one up for myself because I've been wanting to try this I've heard amazing things about this face wash this is the purity made simple one-step facial cleanser with meadow foam seed oil face wash and this is by philosophy and i've heard really good things about this um especially for sensitive skin so i really wanted to try that and i also got Bli the bliss gold Ugh, what am i saying i got the bliss rose gold rescue soothing toner mist for sensitive skin this just screamed at me because sensitive skin rose gold toner a mist i love skincare products that are in mist form because i feel like i don't really have to touch my face that much compared to when i when skincare is in a cream form so i was about to spray this but i have makeup on so let me not um i believe that's all the skincare i got okay i'm gonna start with this because i already started using this and i'm sorry guys i couldn't wait i really wanted to try this this is the morphe brush collection collection by lisa frank um and I haven't tried these brushes yet. It comes with five eyeshadow brushes, which I really needed. I needed some new eyeshadow brushes. You know, it comes with the blending, a smaller blending. I guess this is for inner corner, 
um, your lid, another blending, you know, I really needed this and I can already tell that the quality is amazing. And it came in this really cute like leopard or cheetah, not really sure, but um, it came in this makeup bag which is perfect for traveling. So right now I haven't used them so I'm keeping them in here. It also came with this, ooh it's kind of dirty. I already started using this. This is the, um, I guess, contour brush. Um, but I use it for blush. I've been using it for blush. It's just so soft. It feels so good on the face. I love it. Yes. Okay. So I got this brush collection. It was also really cheap. Like, I don't remember. But guys, just trust me. It was a good deal. Um, yeah. What's wrong with me? And then I got this palette. And woo! -hoo, I'm so excited about this. This is the Juvia's Place palette in The Warrior. And I actually forgot what it looks like, but when I was looking online, it was really pretty. So let me open it. I haven't opened it since I got it. Guys, I love the people that are doing construction in my kitchen because they literally blast Spanish music all the time. And they're singing and dancing and it's just so funny and like it's cute working and have a good time. I'm all about that. Anyway, so this is the palette. Can we just talk about the packaging? I love it. She's cute. She's thick. She's she's a boss ass bitch. We love her. All right. Oh my god. Oh yeah. I just like got a little tingly right there. Oh yes, bitch. Look at these colors. Wow. I'm in love, guys. Look at these. These are right up my alley because I love doing bronze and gold and neutral looks. Let me swatch some colors for you guys. So I'm gonna swatch. Um, Idia or Idia? Idia or Idia? So I'm gonna take that color. <gasps> oh my god! <laughs> Let me swatch that for you guys. Oh my god, do you guys see? Do you see how pigmented that is? Wow, okay, I'm gonna swatch. Now I'm gonna swatch Dahomey. Oh! Were they trying to name it like Dahomey? Like you're the homie? I don't know. But this is the homie. Oh my god. Oh yeah. And again, let me swatch that. Okay. Wow. I can't wait to wear this. I'm a fail at showing you guys swatches, but I'm excited about this. And this was also like half off. I should have picked up more, but I have so much makeup I did not need anymore. So yeah, I got this palette, which is mm, Chef's kiss. And I also picked up, oh, it's kind of dusty already, the Morphe setting mist just because everyone has this, everyone raves about it, but I've never tried it. And I have been using it. And I'm gonna keep on buying this shit. It's amazing. Love it. Need it. I don't know why I'm so happy today. And then I got two lippies. Um, I got a ColourPop lippy and a MAC lippy. This is why I love Ulta, you know? They have ColourPop, Morphe, MAC, Benefit, you know, everything you need. Um, so the ColourPop lip, um, matte lipstick that I picked up is in the color Cypress Chill. And I actually haven't even opened it. So, yeah, this is totally up my alley, especially for the holidays. So pretty. I, I want to swatch it, but I don't want to. Let me swatch it. You guys deserve a swatch. Okay, let me swatch it. Okay, that was a fail. Ooh, that's so pretty. I love that color. Cool, so I'm very happy about my new holiday lippy. Um, I'm gonna throw this thing out. <clears throat> then I also got a um, MAC lipstick and you wouldn't get it. It's another mauve color. I'm obsessed with mauves, obviously. I also did, um, when I was ordering this online, because I ordered for pickup, I also did add Velvet Teddy to my uh, cart because I'm running out, but it was sold out and they just refunded me. But this is the color. Yes, this is right up my alley. This is, I feel like it's the same freaking color as this. I can't, let me swatch this. No, it's different. Um, this is the MAC one and that's color pop. This one has like berry hues and this is like more of a um, dark tone, earthy color. I'll forever be a fan of MAC lipsticks. 
All right, and I, I believe I only got two more things from Ulta. Um, the rest I put in my giveaway. Um, but I just got these two lotions and I always need to stock up on lotions because like, you know, after the pandemic, you're washing, washing, washing your hands. And I don't know about you guys, but my hands get so dry and I cannot function with dry hands. So I just, um, they had like a five for five deal. So I picked up two of these lotions um, and three other things I gave to the giveaway winner. This one smells so good. I started using this. This one's in sugar cookie and this one's in gumdrop. I haven't actually smelled it yet. Oh, wow. Okay, that's even better. Kind of tempted. I'm going to moisturize right now. Um, I plan on putting this in my car after I film my video. Oh yeah, it smells so good. It literally smells like sugar cookies. So that's all I got from Ulta. I did want to show you um, what my cousins got me for my birthday because it involves makeup. And I mentioned this in my Mexico vlog, but if you don't watch that, then I'm going to show you again. If my cousins are watching this, you're the bomb.com. I can't believe you got me two of these. Two. They got me two of the Rare Beauty palettes. And, ugh, the colors are immaculate, and I love that they're travel size. So this is the, um, this is the one in Magnetic Spirit. This is Magnetic Spirit. And let me show you the colors. They're just so pretty. This is the one I took to Mexico. I love it. They're so beautiful, so fun. Um, I'll do a swatch of this magenta one over here just so you can see how pigmented it is and how the color is just beautiful, like covered. Look how pretty that is. You do have to build it up. It's not as pigmented as the Juvia's because it's more like of a built up um, sort of eyeshadow, but it's so pretty and um, I haven't used this purple one yet, but I'll swatch it for you Yeah, this one is oh, this is bomb diggity. This is very pigmented So let's swatch it Yeah, there we go There we go. Yeah, so love love this and I love that I can travel with it It's not too big and they also got me the blue one, this one is called Confident Energy. We love that. We love confidence and we love energy. So, yes, this is giving me Tropics vibes. I should have probably taken this one to Mexico. But, woo, I love these. I would love to create, like, a crazy look with these two colors. I'm going to swatch the blue one. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. No way. I'm do this, guys. Okay, can you even... Oh, they're right over here. Okay. Yeah, boy. Okay, and I'm gonna swatch the green one as well. The sounds I'm making in my room right now, my mom's probably like, what the hell is she doing? Wow. Oh, just look at how these two look. Even the purple and the green look really good together. Anyways. Hey, cousins. I uh, love this. Die for this. Thank you very much. They also got me a blush from Rare Beauty um, in Grateful. And this is really cute. It's sheer, so it's not this red, but uh, you could definitely build it up. I forgot to show you guys, but I also picked this up from Ulta. This is the Juvia's Place. I am Magic Velvety Matte Foundation. I've worn this. I wore it like a week ago, and I really, really like it. The only issue is that I think I got a shade too light or... Um, I'm just very tan for Mexico and I'm still waiting on going back to my regular color. But very, 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 very good foundation. I love it. All right, so makeup wise, I believe that's all I got. Um, I did not feel the need to get too much, guys. Um, but I did pick up a few things from TJ Maxx. I don't even know if they were having a Black Friday sale. I just wanted stuff from there. So I'll show you. So I bought a few things from TJ Maxx. Um, I bought some Christmas decorations, but I showed you guys in my vlog that I bought that. Oh my god, how did I already get this dirty? I think I got eyeshadow on this. But I, from the boys section of TJ Maxx, I bought a pair of Puma sweats because um, they're cheaper. How much was this? Oh my god, guys. So the girl didn't know the price of this because the tag was missing. So she gave it to me for $7.99. And I was like... I love you, girl. But, uh, yeah. I've just always wanted a pair of Puma sweats, so here I am. If you're small like me, 
I recommend you go to the kids section and try to find like extra large or large or extra extra large in kids because those are kind of like never sold out and you'll find a lot of steals. Um, I also just picked up this sweater. This was $12.99. As you can tell, I love like cable net v-neck sweaters, so I just picked up another one. It's like charcoal gray. Very cute. Love it. I picked up this hoodie. Camo hoodie. And it, it's cropped, I believe. And it has like a little peekaboo cutout um, above the chest area. As you can tell, the theme of this video is comfy clothes only. <laughs> Exhibit C. I bought this huge cardigan because I love cardigans. I don't really have that many. And this is just so cute and so pretty and fluffy and soft and mm, I can't wait to wear this. And then I just had to guys. I had to. I bought a Christmas sweater and I bought an ugly Christmas sweater. Look at this. I can't wait to wear this. Um, I doubt I'm going to any parties this holiday season, but you know what? I'll just wear it around the house. I'll wear it for the vlog and this sweater can be recycled for next year when the vaccine comes out. I hope so. And I already showed you guys the pajamas I bought um, at Walmart, but I wanted to show you again because it just makes me really happy. These soft pajamas from Walmart. So, so soft. So soft. I bought this matching pajama set. This is also very very soft it has penguins on it and the top has a big penguin on it and it just makes me really happy you have to buy things that make you happy guys that's so funny i'm wearing a u.s polo um sweater and these are u.s polo too so you know what i'm gonna wear these today look that is so funny okay and they're gray so it would look cute anyways so yes also got these from the boys section. Score. And it was $12.99. The last thing I got, I actually got a matching hoodies for my men's and I. Um, nothing too crazy, just a Nike hoodie. It's gray. You know, it's always cute when you match with your man's. And yeah, guys, it's basically it. I did buy some like home decor, but I showed you guys in my last vlog. And you guys, you have to watch my other vlogs. You have to. You just have to. Yeah. This video's not over yet. I do want to vlog a little bit more, but I'm tired, and I can't believe I wore makeup this early. Like, it's freaking 10 a.m. Why not? Uh, yeah, so I'm going to clean all this stuff up, put it, put it away. I'm hungry, like I always am, and I really want to make avocado toast, but our freaking kitchen is under construction, and the base, the kitchen, the basement is just like, I don't like it. So I'll probably go get Starbucks.